Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Today I'm doing a food video. <laughs> they normally go down well, you guys normally like the recent eats and shopping, food shopping things. So when uh, a company reached out to me and it was a food item, I thought you might be interested. Uh, we have a little gilly there. Ruben is asleep, so um, it's basically the lovely guys over at Gookido, G-U-U-G-U-G-O-O-K-I-E dough, reached out to me and wanted to know if I would be interested in trying their products. So full transparency, uh, I have been gifted the items shown in this video, so I've got these things for free. Um, I'm not being paid for the video, they have just asked me to review the items. Um, so yes, they are kind of like something I've never really heard of before I had the email. Um, and then when I did a little bit of research, I was like, how did I not find this stuff when I was pregnant? Um, I think most of us know that cookie dough is amazing. But most of us know you shouldn't eat it because of the raw egg situation and then when you're pregnant you really really don't eat raw eggs um this stuff is egg free so you can eat it raw and it's safe you can eat it when you're pregnant and it's all safe um so yeah you can actually eat this and not have to worry um about the egg situation which i think is awesome i'm just saying Got it. I didn't find this when I was pregnant. Uh, so the flavours that I have got are Bonetti Cake Batter, Red Velvet, um, Gooey Chocolate Chip, and Triple Chocolate Fudge. Sounds amazing. Um, just so you're aware, the lice guys... Oh! Real life in the beach house. The lovely guys over at Gookie Dough have, that's the postman, I think. The lovely guys at Gookie Dough have given us a 10% discount code, um, which I will put all the details below if you want to check them out. They came really well packaged. They come in a box with a cold gel pack because um, these do need to stay cool. They go in the fridge and then um, if you don't eat them all in one go, they go in the freezer. Um, so yeah, they come packaged really well, so I thought this would be an awesome gift to send somebody, especially in lockdown. You intrigued, Darwin? <laughs> so I thought what I'd do is have a little bit of a taste test at the cookie stage, and then I'll do like a part later on in the week where I actually bake some cookies and see what they're like then. Um, I'm going for the funetti. Just why would oh oh that smells amazing. I'm ready with my fancy spoon. Mm. It's not for puppy dogs. which is dangerous. Not because of the uh, ingredients, just because I reckon I could eat the whole lot. Hmm. So one serving, half a tub, is 292 calories. Not gonna lie, worth it. Hmm. That is so good. So yummy. Mm -mm -mm. So as I said, I'm going to try and not eat all of this in one go. And then later on in the week, I'm going to make some cookies. Um, and I might even let John taste a cookie, see what he thinks. I might not. They might all get demolished. Um, all right. I'm going to try the red velvet. Because why not? I'm sure you didn't all come here to watch me eat, but that's what's going to happen. 
not gonna lie i'm not the biggest red velvet fan like red velvet cake mm. oh i actually taste cakey red cocoa cookie dough with white chocolate fudge Mm. that is okay that's not as good as the funetti but then i'm not a fan of, of red velvet cake should we go in for the gooey chocolate chip i don't quite know <laughs> what you're getting from watching me eat cookie dough unless you're one of those people that are into that then you know hi Mmm. Mm. I'm sorry about the double dipping, but mm. that's like traditional proper cookies. It makes kind of makes me think of when I was a kid. When I was a little little kid, my mum used to do baking on a regular, and like the best bit was getting to lick the spoon, wasn't it? So this is triple chocolate fudge. Like, my mum would be doing all the work and I'd be there cleaning, cleaning the bowls. Mmm. Gourmet edible cookie dough, triple chocolate fudge. Yes, mate. I'm going to say, the Fanetti is my favourite. That chocolate is pretty epic. Why didn't I find you when I was pregnant and craving this stuff? So yeah, that's, you know, six minutes of me sat here eating things. That was a sneeze from an awake Reuben. So yeah, yum, absolutely yum in the dough form. Uh, next time you see me, I'll be making cookies. Hello, this is Editing Katie with awful hair a messy background and really bad lighting. Um, the next clip I ramble on for about 11 minutes about how I really love cooking and I really love baking but I'm really bad at baking. Um, I've got some of the gear but no idea uh, is the gist but rather than you suffer those 11 minutes I thought I would jump on and do this. And I have popped some of the cookie dough into the oven see what the actual cookies taste like gotta admit there isn't as much of the finetti dough left because that is my favorite and i have it most of the pot in its dough form but yeah i've baked some cookies i did some with a star cookie cutter i think i rolled them too thin because they look quite crisp um and then i did some round ones that are still um, they're little, but they look more chewy in the middle. I'll show you what they look like. Um, so I've done two of each flavour as a star, and as you can tell, they are, like, this is Finetti. And I think I've done them too thin. <laughs> they're a bit more like a biscuit than a cookie. Where are these? They're a bit more doughy in the middle. But yeah, I'm like ready to try them in a different form um so yeah i'm gonna say if i was gonna put them in like favorite like this one is definitely my favorite then that one then that one and then the red velvet but i'm one of those weirdos i don't actually like red velvet cake it's still yummy um but definitely my least favorite of the four so i'm gonna have a try of these and i'm also gonna get john to join in so John has just refreshed his memory and tried all the doughs again. So what's your favourite dough? Chocolate chip. Is it chocolate chip? Gooey chocolate chip. Mm, mine, oh, mine's the Finetti. I don't think. That one. There's a massive amount of difference in those two. Bit sweeter. That's got John's chocolate. That's got sprinkles. In. Yeah. yeah they're, they're kind of similar. I think we shall be getting a big tub of that one. They do yeah, big tubs. That, that's right. I wonder So yeah, so John is going to try a cookie. What flavour do you want? 
Well, I won't try all of them, but I'll try. I'll try. <laughs> Don't think they want to watch all of it. But... Oh no, well, but okay. So that's the triple chocolate. Does it taste any different from what it tastes like in the dough wise? Yeah. That's good that. I've got a finetti one. Mmm. They're still a bit warm, so that's good. Yeah. Soft in the centre, aren't they? Mm. They're nice. I'm gonna try a star one. I'm gonna try the red velvet because that is my least favourite dough, and I say. Well, that is not as sweet as I thought it was going to be. It's because you have phonetic cupcakes sometimes, and they're too sweet. And every time you have them, you realise that they're too sweet. Mm. And that isn't. It's more of a subtle flavour, but it's definitely phonetic. Right, these are thinner the star ones. Mm, they're definitely more crisp. Oh, I like that. Red velvet. Hmm. I prefer mm. it as a cookie or a biscuit. These are more biscuit. No, do is the dough. Hmm. I don't think we should try them all on camera because it's going to be really boring. But well, we've got one more. Let's try it that free. <laughs> Another little, aren't they? Hmm. They're only little because I've had a lot of the dough. It's a favourite like cookie. I like the chocolate chip. You like the chocolate chip? Yeah. But they're good, aren't they? We'd, like I say, we're definitely going to buy some. Triple chocolate. Tri if, you, if you really like chocolate, that is good. But, personal favourite, that one. There will be a discount code if you want to try it. If you do, or you've already tried them because they've been around for a while. Eating with my, speaking with a mouthful. Let me know in the comments below what you think your favourite flavour would be. I really don't know how to end this video. It's all just been me eating. Oh, <laughs> but yeah. They're nice, aren't they? They are good. Moorish. Yeah. I have already yeah. got a cup of tea prepared to smash the rest of these. I don't think a little tubs. Oh no, we're going to buy the big tub. I think you need big tubs. We're going to buy the big tub. But yeah. I, don't think little tubs quiet. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. Um, yeah, and we'll talk to you in the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.